And in case you missed it, there was a big announcement last night for the Coast Guard station in Grand Haven. The leader of the U.S. Coast Guard unveiled the new name of the Grand Haven station in honor of the late Commander Michael Smith. Smith, who served for years as the executive director of the Coast Guard Festival, passed away unexpectedly last year. We're told the renaming of the Sector Field Office is a project that's been in the works for a little more than a year. A portrait of Smith was also commissioned and will be hung in the station. Tremendous impact on the city of Grand Haven uh, and the Coast Guard as a whole. Uh, Mike served for well over 20 years uh, as an active duty Coast Guard member and after retiring, uh, retired to Grand Haven with his family, uh, was very involved within the community and then um, took on the role of festival director where he served for 17 years. So Mike's been not only a member of the Coast Guard, but giving back to the Coast Guard uh, for that entire time. And we're told the building is currently under construction and is expected to be finished sometime in October. October. That's when the signage that was revealed last night will be put above the door. Juliet, you were there as an honoree for at the honorees dinner last night when this announcement was oh, made. What was that like? It was so wonderful because the head of the mm -hmm. U.S. Coast Guard unveiled the sign. We're going to show it to you later. We have pictures of it and then the uh, the beautiful portrait of Mike. So I've known Mike for as many years as I've been doing the Coast Guard <laughs> Festival and he was a fashionista. Mm -hmm. He planned every outfit for every day and so this is such a great tribute for him and everybody misses him so much. I think a lot of people remember those outfits and that's <laughs> it's such a great tribute to a great person and too. shoes some of his shoes remind <laughs> me of the shoes george has absolutely